Hi, I'm Julie. Welcome to my channel. I've got a fun video for you today. When we first bought this house, I really wanted to create a faux fireplace in my living room. But after I refinished that console table, I didn't want to displace it. So I decided to build a mantel shelf instead. My husband brought home a piece of pine board and I got busy designing the corbels that I wanted to use to hold up the shelf. I first drew it on a piece of paper and cut that out and then I laid it on the pine board and traced around it. My husband cut it out with a jigsaw. Next, I use my sander to sand them smooth. I began with 80 grit sandpaper. Once the corbels were smooth, I began working on the large piece. And then I switched to 120 grit sandpaper. Finally, I switched to 220 grit. Once I completed all the sanding, I wiped everything down with a damp cloth to remove all the sawdust. We decided we wanted to keep the shelf its natural color, so I started the process of using the polyacrylic and finishing it off. I wanted to whitewash the corbels, so I mixed up this Wayfair chalk paint in white along with some water just so I had a runny consistency, and then I just painted the corbels with it. Now we decided that we wanted to stain this piece of wood, so I had to go back with my sander and remove the polyacrylic that I had already put on this piece of wood. And I decided to use this Minwax wood stain in weathered oak.
after I got everything stained, then it was time for the polyacrylic again. I put on three coats of polyacrylic, letting each coat dry and sanding between. Next, I prep my wall by filling in the holes and painting. My husband drilled the corbels into the studs of the wall, and then we laid the shelf on top and measured and leveled. <music> Next, it was time for me to fill in the holes made by the drill. 